it is looking like it's going to be Raquel Pennington and Juliana for the title. You're obviously familiar with both of them. What are your thoughts on that hypothetical matchup? Well, gosh, I've trained a lot with Juliana Pena more earlier in our careers, and she is a spitball, spitfire. I mean, I think you guys saw that best on display when she fought Amanda. Um, but I think she's always been very underestimated. She's an amazing, amazing ground game. And her striking, people don't appreciate it because it doesn't look pretty. But a lot of times pretty isn't hard enough in women's MMA. Like, you got to hit hard, and you, you got to do it – you got to do it with everything that you have in order for it to, to, to make that knockout kind of difference. And she hits way, way, way harder than anybody would anticipate, you know, because she looks wild and crazy and off balance. But it's hard to find somebody to mimic that at the same time because everybody wants to be so perfect. Um, and I, so I like that she makes it messy. I like that she makes it a little crazy. I like that people underestimate her style. Um, and then, you know, with Raquel, she's, she's clean. Her her boxing, her hands, everything's very clean. And I swear that her like lower body is like filled with like concrete or something. Because I've trained with her before too and she's, and obviously I fought her. And I, I definitely don't think, I wasn't at my best when I fought her, but um, she's so hard to move. Like she's just like a tree, she's just planted in the ground. So I think it would be tough for Juliana to take her down, but um, it'll be exciting to see, I think. It was a good fight, yeah. Oh, yeah.